In question 5 of this exercise, the problem statement says, if Chameli had rupees 600 left after spending 75% of her money, how much did she have in the beginning? So Chameli had some money in the beginning. She spent 75% of that money and she was left with rupees 600. So we have to find out how much money she had in the beginning. So the observation we make to solve this problem is that the money spent by Chameli as a percentage is 75%. 75% of whatever money she had in the beginning, which means that the money left, money she has left as a percentage of the original money will be 100 minus 75, this much percentage or 25%. 25%. So Chameli had, Chameli has 25% of the original money left. And this is equal to rupees 600 because we are told that she has rupees 600 left. So this means that 25% of original money, the original amount is equal to rupees 600. And from here we have to find the original amount. So there are two ways to do it. You could form an equation in the unknown. So let's do that first. So we'll uh, do the equation approach. So in this approach, we will suppose that the unknown, which is the original amount of uh, money, we will suppose that this is equal to rupees x. Okay, so now 25% of rupees x is rupees 600. So 25% of rupees x is equal to rupees 600 which means that uh, we can now write an equation in x 25 by 100 into x is equal to 600 and from here we can find the value of x so 100 by 25 is 4 and now we cross multiply this 4 with 600 so we get x equal to 2400 so the original amount that Chameli had was 2400 she spent 75 percent of it 75 percent of 24 is 1800 and after that she was left with 25% or rupees 600. The other approach to find the same answer is the unit tree method approach. So unit tree method approach and in this in this approach we observe that 25% uh, of the original amount is 16 uh, 600. So we will write 25% of original amount let me write it in shorthand of original amount is rupees 600. This means that 1% of original amount, so 1% of original amount is rupees 600 by 25. So rupees 600 by 25 and hence 100% of original amount will be what will the 100% of original amount be? Will be this rupees 600 by 25 into 100. So this will be the 100. This will be 100% of the original amount. So 100 by 25 is 4, and 600 into 4 is 2400. Once again, so the original amount is rupees 2400. So let me recap the unitary method again. We say that 25% of the original amount is 600. Hence, 1% of the original amount is 600 by 25. And hence, 100% of the original amount is 600 by 25 into 100. And this comes out to be rupees 2400 again. So the answer to question 5 is that Chameli had rupees 2400 in the beginning. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.